Hello fellow gamers and welcome back to EU Forward Boxing Gaming. Okay, so as you can see I just loaded back into this game and these are the only pop-ups that I got. That's <laughs> crazy, normally you get like up to here or even two lines. Um, pretty insane. Now, this is going to be annoying, I can't fabricate on them. I also think I can't core it, correct? So that's going to be a bit annoying. Um, what else are we doing? Oh yeah, we... We're integrating Chimu, 24%. And we were... Oh, we have 100% 40. Okay, we need to do that immediately. Okay. So, we need to get all these done before the Western nations come. Because we can't reform um, if we have a core province bordering our core province. So, yeah. That's nice. You know, that's all, that's all really good. The thing is, we need this colonist. So we'll lower our stability by two and plunge the nation into civil war. Yes, because I don't think our, our authority can go higher than a hundred. Is it capped at a hundred? I don't know. Probably. I mean, so we get some revolt pretender rebels everywhere. It's quite a few, but it's not that bad. I'm gonna grab more. Hopefully Chimu will chime in. <laughs> Sorry. And we don't want to lose stability just yet. Actually. Wait, we already did that. Look at that. We're already at zero. We're already, yeah. Alright, so we're gonna... This is annoying because there's mountains. So it's gonna cause a pretty bad things for us. Now, the first thing we need to do is get a colonist, and I think we're going to want this province here. Because then we can uh, attack them as well, easily, with a, with a claim, and also core it, so that'll be nice. Um, Removing the Waka is enough. Or, the chief is executed and loyal servant is appointed, okay. This will mean we get more rebels, this means we get also more rebels. Uh, I kind of want to have this one, but Esmeraldas. Where's Esmeraldas? There. Oh, it's all, that's annoying. Um, that is annoying. Okay, well. Uh, I could have waited a little bit, but it's just in the way. It's annoying. Oh, what the hell happened to our morale? What? Why did we... Why did we start at zero morale? We were not at zero morale. Um... Okay. Weird. Well, that's not good. <laughs> Especially the fact that we don't have any, uh... Okay, well there's that. That's good. Now, we need to get mercs because this is gonna be way too painful for us. I'm gonna need all the mercs. A bit dangerous because we're gonna go bankrupt maybe, but we need them mercs. We're gonna be in too much trouble if we don't do this. Cause the thing is we don't have manpower, so now the thing is though I don't really need manpower. I'm not I'm not at war with anyone and I'm not going to be at war with anyone. That's the good thing about it. Um the bad news Uh, the bad news, I guess. Oh, look at that again. We don't have any morale. I don't understand this. They don't have any more morale than me. They don't have more tip tactics. They don't have any better units. It's bizarre.
At least I find that bizarre. Look at look at him around. Okay, well now it was actually decent. So uh, that's mountains, so we don't want to fight that. Oh wait, he's attacking me. Uh, am I missing something so badly? I mean, sure, we have a little bit less morale, but it's really not that much. We have twice the troops, and we have a minus two. Okay, no, I'm not. I was not missing something there. <laughs> I was like, surely this cannot. Yeah, okay, that's good. Oh, well, I guess consolidating might be better. That's something to uh, keep in mind. Eh, you know, whatever. We blew a lot of money on that, but we passed the first reform. We're already at 14 again, so we do go incredibly quick through these things, man. Is this mountains as well? God, all this crap is mountains. Well, we have doubled the men, the men but... I'm a bit scared after last time. Uh, our general's... Our king is pretty awesome, isn't he? 536. We don't want to get rid of him. Alright, let's just go. You arrived a little bit earlier. Okay, now our morale started at full, see that? It's, it's shrinking rapidly, but... Okie dokie, there we go. Wow. We need to consolidate so badly. Put some there. Some there. Put the rest there. Okay, now we still have the oh god. Uh, we'll probably use it on the stability. I'll probably pay it. Yeah, whatever. Too late now. Normally, I like to um, increase the stability by myself first, so that actually it's worth more. But that's okay. Oh, phew. That was a bit crazy, that first fight. Uh, maybe I was just not paying attention to the morale or anything, but... I, I thought I was on full morale, and then when I got into the battle, suddenly I was not. Can we... Uh, okay. Not much we can do about that, really. What is this? Oh, we can form the Inca. Okay, cool. Let's do that. Let me just unseat this crap first. Yay. Yay! Royal Mar no. Defeat rebels. Uh, yes. Okay. <laughs> you mean these? <laughs> can we now claim claim this already? I wonder. Oh, we can, even though we just have a colony. Okay. Claim. Now, the most important thing for us to do is stabilize, get a bit of manpower back, which we are doing now. And I think what we'll do is we're not going to build any more troops. We'll just stick with these... Uh, I'll probably get rid of a few rebels, but not all of them. Like, does that shoot? No, not yet. So, no, we need to slowly replace them with actual troops. Come on. I don't, I don't want to form the Incan Empire when I still have rebels. That would be bad luck, I think. <laughs> Yay! Alright, so... We'll just get rid of these as well, and then we'll make big ducats again. 1.6. Big ducats. Form lines, royal marriage, no. We don't want any of these missions. Go away. Let's form Inca. Okay, to claim the Andes. Where's the Andes? Anyways. Boom! Ugh, that collar. Oh, we have a claim right there. I can't even see it. I think we're a bit early. <laughs> okay. Now, I think... Uh, it's a derpy flag, by the way. Um, I think the IDs are fairly dis fairly similar, to be honest. So, that's not going to change much. Okay. Well, I'm happy. Let's continue. Oh, we do have these... Oh, we do have these seven troops. That's nice. That will help us defeat Muiska. 
Which I think we can do straight away. I don't think that's going to be an issue. Hey, did, did my rebels just go away from being becoming Inca? They did. Or maybe it was just random, but... Okay, then. Um, no, we don't have a claim yet, do we? No, we don't. What do you have? Can I, what kind of army am I looking at here? 7,000. Oh, that's not bad, actually. I mean, it's not enough, but it's not bad. Yay, almost 2,000 manpower. <laughs> You're getting it so slow. It's just insane. Alright, 90... F Yay, 100%. Yay. How much do we get per year now? 7. That's pretty nice. Okie dokie. Declare war. Declare war. I'm just going to go straight to the capital. It's mountains and it's a river. It's very bad for us, but I think we just had to. I don't know how big that country is. I think it's pretty big because I had 7,000 troops. It's, it's quite a bit. Um, Tolerance of True Faith is pretty nice. And that lasts forever. Okay. Yeah, we'll do that. Of course. These sort of things you always need. Hey. What is this? You're not allied with them, sadly. But that might mean that we can actually start going upwards towards the Mayans. And that would mean that my whole rant about having slow progression is not uh, right. Oh, crap. Don't fight. Oh, hang on. What is this? The coastal Chimu people are the carriers of one of the oldest cultures. Well, not anymore. As, as the lands have now come under our control, we cannot help but marvel. Okay. Uh, all right. What can we do? Oh, crap. What is this? Integration of Chimu customs, which gets gives us... Oh, crap. Minus five? <sighs> but... But the problem is that we will then get less authority. But if we can still pull it off to westernize before them, it'll be worth it. I think we should do this, to be honest. We will be able to catch up and tech so fast once we westernize. Let's do it. It's going to suck at start. It's, and it's not going to be worth it for another 100 years, I think. But in the end, it will be. It definitely will be, 100% certain. I think. <laughs> you should really should not use 100% certain and I think in the same sentence, but... Oh. What is this? Oh, uh, what is the Diplo? What is this? Must make his sister as his primary wife. Okay. Uh, eh. Eh. <laughs> um. Sixty-five percent. Okay. Approval. Yay. And we'll definitely take the authority. We're going to take authority all the way. Um, because apparently we really need to get our religion reformed before uh, we westernize. So, you know, we're going to do every single every single thing that we can to make that happen, hopefully. Now, I do want to take the first tech, actually. How much does that actually cost us? 1400 Oh, wow. Look at that. Uh, is it it's not really useful though, is it? Yeah, it's not really useful, so maybe we shouldn't do it. No. We're not going to get an ID group till uh, attack 4. <laughs> Which I don't even know how you get there. Like, I mean, I know how you get there, but it's going to take so incredibly long, right? It must take forever. Anyways, that will be 100%. We will just full annex them as always. Uh, eh. And uh, see where we go from there. Full annexation, thank you. 
Because again, the more uh, base tax we have, the better it is for us. Oh crap, that's expensive. 60% overextension. Uh, okay. We might have some issues. The rebels. 14.9%. Oh, of course, the culture is not accepted. The religion is not accepted. Uh, we're going to have to increase. I'm not even going to take that risk. I could just let them rebel, but I just don't want to reduce overextension. We'll take that. And then afterwards, we'll take the uh, religion one because we have to convert this stuff immediately. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Oh, that one again. Uh, we'll take... No, actually, we'll... We'll take the prestige. We don't really need it, but at the same time, we don't need our army right now. Uh, 1478. Tax modifier, stability cost. I don't care about the stability cost. And it's only one year, so I'm going to take this. National tax for one year is kind of meh, but at the same time, it's not that great. Wanka Pampa. Okay. Now, do we just want to get uh, like the highest base tax that we can find along the uh, coast, or do we want to actually go towards like? Well, I guess we can't go there because we can't see it yet. So there's that. Yeah, I think we'll just go for the highest base tax, maybe around here because we have claims there already as well. So it must be easy to core, maybe. And look at that. There's no aggressiveness anything or anything here it's kind of meh land though one base stacks two base stacks one base stack. oh that's four that's kind of nice um, the other option we have is to um, go across the land here I think there's a like a land bridge from here all the way to the eastern side of South America so we could do that too colonizing I might just do a, a mixed bag of everything, I think. Okay, do we have a new trade node here, maybe? No, we can't see it yet. Okay. Maybe I just want to collect here. Uh, I don't think I, No, this will be better. Okay. Did we lose authority? What the hell? That was at 20 something. Did I take an event that did that? If so, I did not mean to do that. Um, okay. I want to have a look at our autonomy because we want to increase that as much as we can. I mean, decrease it. Yeah, this stuff is all... Well, I can go down, but we might get some rebels. Thing is, though, I don't mind rebels that much. We're gonna take some rebels everywhere. Uh, I just want to have a look at like this is points uh, seven point six, and if I do this, seven point eight. I mean, that's you know that's a, that's still a bit. It's not great. Like it's not massive, but it's something. Seven, I'm a bit... L that's three percent that it will not go away. Although we are core, aren't we? Okay, let's wait till we core and then we'll do that again. Sounds like a decent enough plan to me. Yeah, still so oh, zero because... Oops. My bad. I'm not going to take it till I absolutely have to. How's that? Sounds reasonable to me. Uh, yeah, I guess uh, all we can do is just put it at f speed 5 and go through it, right? I kind of wish I would discover this bloody country there. <laughs> I'm going to have to keep an eye on the reform. It's going pretty quick now. I just wish we got a few more events to do with that. I mean, I can't make it any faster, I think. Right, I think I've done absolutely everything. Yeah, I know I have claims here, but... <laughs> What's the point? Oh no, my general's dead. Oh no. We shall remember him fondly. I mean, I guess he's done some things, right? He was kind of bad, but hey. He did some stuff. Wow, this coring takes forever, by the way. 
They're pretty good provinces though. There's 100 admin points for this, for Tunja. Five base tax, pretty good. Oh, seaborne merchants, okay. Uh, our heir will go on a long voyage and might may not return. Okay, it kind of sucks. Bye. So is that one of those things where we might find the Holy Grail and stuff? Wait, this is almost done. Nice. Convert. Oh, 200. Holy. What? Why? Not accept the culture minus two. Oh. Okay. Well, I guess. I guess we're not going to convert that then. Yes, colony's done. Okay. Uh, I kind of want to go inland, I guess. I, I, I want this, but it's too far away. It's only one base axe, but I like it. Alright, so I guess we'll just get the highest base axe that we can find. I prefer not to do this because it's landlocked, I think. Well, it goes up there, but... So let's go for... Wasn't there not four base stacks here? Three... One. There's a four, but like in here would be good to go to the east. Uh, we do need like let's say six troops. Uh, it is animus though. See the problem is these are not, so I could easily take these and I wouldn't have to come. Yeah, whatever. It's fine. I keep clicking on that. Uh, we might actually take the military tech, cause okay, okay, fortify. Yeah, okay. We convert neighbor to inti. Um, yeah, but it's gonna take too long. So we'll fortify Costco, which is our home, isn't it? It is. There you go. I like these missions. Wow, that takes almost a year to build. <laughs> Not almost a year, it takes a full year to build. That's pretty insane. Uh, this helps with the missionary strength, but I don't know. Uh, also, I'll take the admin tech one, just because I don't want to forget. Because every point is so crucial right now. Okay, ducats. Oh, what is this? Hey, heat returns. What a great story. Let us see what we have. Oh. Until the death of Tupac Yupanqui Hanan. But who is that? Is that my heir or my... No, it's my dude. He is 36. Yeah, I mean, 10% is a lot because that is... 100 something. Well, this will only give me 50. So, just to make sure I actually can take that, I guess we'll just do that immediately. Okay, so I think that's one of those missions that, or events that can also bring you to the, the like the holy uh, fountain and stuff. I think, maybe. Uh, chiquitos, no, we don't want that because because we no, we're gonna have to redirect them. Because we we can't get a second colony, so I don't really want to do that. Don't want to do that. Okay, guys, I'm going to end the episode here. Um, pretty good episode, I think. Uh, we formed the Incan Empire. We got rid of our last dude up here. There's only one left there, and I really want to know what that is. It must be one of the Mayans, maybe. Or not. Maybe not. That's a bit... They're a bit further away. But if it is, we'll have some good fights on our hands. That'd be interesting. Hmm, okay. Thanks you very much for watching and I will see you next time.